Hello everyone. I use GoPros in my shop to film my videos because they're sealed against dust and water and they're pretty rugged, but they're not perfect. Uh, last week I made this adapter for my tripod so that my GoPro can use an external battery, which is just a DeWalt USB power source that gives you USB out of any 20 volt or 60 volt battery. Uh, it works pretty well. The only problem with it is that if I go to adjust my tripod, because all the weight's out here on one side, it wants to do that. So today I'm going to be upgrading this build to a full roll cage, which will protect the GoPro from any falls um, beyond how ruggedized it already is, and contain the battery and the GoPro at the center of gravity of this rotation, so that I will get a closer to normal panning and tilting mechanism with this pistol grip tripod, which works wonderfully otherwise. So how do you go about filming your tripod when you only have one? Magnetic base mount, three extension pieces, second GoPro. I guess it works. So what I have here is a ring roller. Uh, this is just a standard Harbor Freight model that I've had for a little while. Um, I think they run about $70. Alright, so this middle span right here is going to have the DeWalt USB power source connected to it. I think I'm just going to epoxy one of those down and I'll be able to slide a battery in and out from the front. Now here's a standard GoPro mount for a tripod and these are some flat wing nuts that have the same thread, and that is how it's gonna mount down. All right, let's do a test fit before everything gets welded up. Here we go, let's go pro in place, and nothing is visible, perfect. All right, everyone, I have my GoPro in here. It's recording right now, it's all set to go. And here it looks from behind. It's very tight fit up here, but it does fit. Um, I'm pretty confident with it. If you've looked up these GoPro uh, Hero 5 Blacks, you know they're $400 and why not? Works for me. Alright, so here we go. Uh, once I get a new battery power supply, that will be right there. Here's the GoPro. And you can see that it does not have any of the metal in its field of view. Um, I'm going to buy a shorter USB cable and this will go right up in there and connect to the GoPro like that. Thank you all for joining me for this little quick video. I'll see you next time.